At Mobility Genie, we recommend the Putnam range of cushions. This is a wedge cushion. A wedge by its nature is higher at the back than it is at the front. So the this is an 11 degree wedge. And the 11 degree wedge has a height at the back of three and three quarter inches. And it slopes as it goes towards the front. The idea of a wedge cushion would be if you have a seat in your car, for example, that has a dip in the middle, a bucket style seat, where the front of the seat of the car is higher than the back. In that situation, the knee is usually higher than the hip. Therefore, it puts the hip and the lower back under pressure. So the idea would be to fill that gap. So you'd fill it with either an 11 degree cushion or it comes in an 8 degree, which is 3 inches at the back. So the 8 degree is 3 inches at the back and the 11 degree is 3 and 3 quarter inches at the back. Generally, the 11 degree would be the most popular. But if you have somebody who's extremely tall and conscious of not having enough overhead space, they may decide to go down to the 8 degree. If you're concerned about which cushion to use, you can get a measuring tape and put it from one side of your car seat to the other, and then use a ruler in the center of the back, and it'll give you an idea of the approximate height that you need. They're made from a high density foam, which gives good support. And they also come with a coccyx cutout at the back. A coccyx cutout would be for somebody who for, has injured their tailbone or the coccyx bone or the surrounding tissue and they need pressure relief when they're driving or when they're sitting. So as you can see, there's the coccyx cutout and it slopes up towards the center of the cushion. So it's extremely good even when you're going over a bumpy road and you are tender, it really does give pressure relief. They come with a strap that can be attached and wrapped around the underseat of the car. And the other way you can use a wedge cushion is if you're working in an office chair and you're leaning forward over a computer or something similar to that. If you have a good supporting chair with a good lumbar roll behind you and you're leaning forward, you're not getting the benefit of the cushion behind you. Whereas with the wedge cushion under you, it tilts your pelvis forward and puts your spine into an S shape, which is the correct posture when you're sitting. And it gives relief to the lower back. Again, depending on your size, you would either use an eight degree or an 11 degree. And if you have a tender coccyx area, you would use the one with the cutout.